He's an inspiration to the younger generation and a real fan favourite, so it was a treat for Golfing World to catch up with Ricky Fowler in his home state, California. The first topic up for discussion is new partnership with renowned coach Butch Harmon. Uh, it's been great. Uh, I've been up to Vegas to see him twice and we've been working together for a few months now and uh, definitely seeing some improvements and um, you know, looking to draw from him. Obviously he's had a, a pretty good career as a coach, uh, taking some guys to number one and a lot of wins and a lot of major championships. So um, looking to learn a lot from him and, and uh, have him point me in the right direction and keep moving forward. Now living in Jupiter, Florida, Ricky's been jetting up to see Harmon in Las Vegas and making what he calls a couple of simple but significant changes to his swing. Shorten up the backswing a little bit, make it uh, a little more simple, and then uh, through impact, uh, keeping the body moving and, and the head moving through the ball. I uh, used to hang back and flip the club a little bit, so uh, just making things more efficient and a little more simple. With Phil Mickelson and Tiger Woods having led the way on the PGA Tour for many years now, Fowler is part of an emerging generation who are ready to step up, challenge the established superstars and make their own mark on the game. Tiger and Phil have definitely made it uh, look a lot easier than it really is to win on the PGA Tour. So uh, it's nice to have one win out here. Uh, obviously a great one. It's uh, Quail Hall, Wells Fargo Championship. Um, fun playoff with, with DA and Rory. but. Uh, you know, I definitely don't want to be just a, a one-time winner. So, uh, you know, looking forward to the 14th season, obviously with some new changes. I have some great people and partners on my side. Um, so looking for a bigger and better year than uh, we've had so far. In 2010 at Celtic Manor in Wales, Ricky was a fresh-faced 21-year-old who became the youngest ever US Ryder Cup team member. And even though America lost, Fowler played well. <laughs> He missed out on the matches at Medina two years later, but is determined to get back in the team for the 2014 event at Glen Eagles in Scotland. That's definitely uh, one of my main goals for the year. Uh, obviously, I want to play well, be in contention, have a chance to win tournaments, get through the FedEx Cup, but uh, I'd say my main goal is to, to be on the team in 14. Um, you know, 2010 Ryder Cup was awesome, but uh, missing out on in 12, uh, I'd like to uh, get back in 14 here. A focused Fowler refined by Harmon, an impressive combination and hopefully a recipe for a Ryder Cup return.